it's my date's birthday tomorrow. Do you not have to have any candles or anything here, do you? Yeah, of course, we'll sort it out. Thank you. What I'm looking for is someone that can prove to me that you can have a fairy tale with someone new. It's because oh it's my your god, birthday. my birthday! <laughs> the gentleman oh has arranged a little birthday surprise oh. for you. Oh my god, that's so sweet! Oh my days! I do fancy her a lot. <laughs> I think she does fancy me a little bit. Wait, wait! What? Okay, so, ah! Uh... He was lush, he was good looking. Happy birthday. Thank you! <laughs> Mum would like him. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Put it down. It's your birthday. Put it down. <laughs> that was like manly. <laughs> Put it down. <laughs> Would you guys like to see each other again? Can I go first? Go for it. Okay. I don't think this is for me. That's that's it. Like I, yeah. I just don't feel that spark that I really wanted. Just don't feel it. He's a nice guy, but I feel really bad for saying this. It's just... It's fine. I think he'll be a nice guy. It's fine. Just... Okay. <laughs> okay. There we go. I, oh, well, obviously I would have liked to see you again, but don't feel awkward. Okay. Because I'm, I'm glad I've met you, because mm -hmm. you're a lovely person. And I hope you do find someone you get that spark with. Thanks. Thank you. Because I keep comparing to my previous relationship. And I think I'm so desperate to have that, like that back, and I don't want anything less. Thank you very much. Thank you. If you do keep looking back, you'll never go forward. And that doesn't have to be with me. I can be with anyone. But you will find someone that makes you happy. Bye. How you doing? I'm good. Is it going well? I think so, a little bit. This is not what I'd normally do, though, on a date. I think I did something else. Like, walking through a gallery is pretty chill. Are you into art, then? A little bit. Do you draw? Do you paint? Portraits, man. Really? Have you seen Titanic? I'd taken the page out of Leonardo DiCaprio's book. <laughs> so, you draw naked women? <laughs> right, okay, okay. <laughs> good to know, very good to know. Yeah. I just flirted with my table accidentally. Accidentally. <laughs> yeah. You might as well just slip your number now. I'm not gonna give him my number. I'll give it to him, please. No, I don't want you to give him my number. It is cute, though. How's the date going? Yeah, it's okay. You know, like looks wise, I think like, he's alright. Like, yeah, I, really I think he's really good looking. You want to slip him your number? I want to slip my number, but he's a good looking boy. I'm just not sure. If you're not sure, that's more of a reason maybe to have a second date. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> Thanks. He's kind of attractive. No, he's very arty, isn't he? He loves it. He really loves it. I think my friends would say, give him a chance, Sophia. Why'd you pie everyone off so easily? I'll get it. No, really, I don't, uh, I don't mind doing hearts. It's my pleasure. She was beautiful. There was a lot of eye contact. But I don't think I got more than that. Are you working much longer? Um, till about 12. What are you yeah. doing after that? Um, I'd love to say something really exciting, but no, probably just hit in the sack, <laughs> yeah. What are you guys doing? See the one taste me. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Hi. Hiya. <laughs> Would you like to see each other again? Who goes first? Yeah, 
Yeah, I mean, yeah, why not? Um, oh, God, are you saying no? <laughs> I didn't feel that's chemistry. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Is it because of the art? Um... <laughs> Yes, the waitress took an interest in my art. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? The one that looks like you. <laughs> what did she say? She said it was interesting. <laughs> was she lying? Is. I think she was lying. Bless her. Oh, God, yeah. Well, it's been really fun. I have had a video with you. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. I enjoyed you too. I think I did feel more of a connection with... The waitress. <laughs> Coming to her date dressed to impress. OMG. Is 32 year old lingerie model Jade. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Hi, how are you? Blonde hair, dressed up to the nines, and just think that you haven't got a brain behind them. Hi. Hiya. But I am a fully trained accountant, believe it or not. <laughs> Everyone calls me Carol Vorsman. No matter where we are, they'll go, oh, here she is now, get Carol Vorsman to do it. Porn star, I love porn star, please. Yeah, of course, no worries. Uh, and how long have you been single now? Oh, God, I've been single now for four years. Four years? Yeah. It's just <laughs> such a waste, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Why have you come to the First Dates restaurant? To be honest, it was me daughter that was she said to me, Mum, I'm not going to be here forever. What happens when I leave home and the dog's not going to be here forever, so what are you going to do then? And I thought, I suppose she's right. What will happen when I haven't got the dog to spoon overnight? So what sort of guy are you looking for? I've got a bit of a criteria, so I did save it in my notes. Can I see? Do you want to see the list? Yeah. So, no snorers, no minors, no pensioners, no living with parents because I don't want a lodger, no one who's miserable, they've got to have, like, the banter and be quite fun, no one with a psycho ex, no one who's a minge bag because, you know, don't want to be paying for everything. <laughs> Someone who can drive properly because I'm always late for things, so I like, can't be really having no tortoises. Mm -hmm. I ideally like someone with a low sex drive. I don't want to be in work worrying, thinking my fellas are home. Not all men, G. Not all of them, but I feel like there's less chance that they've got a low sex drive, don't you? <laughs> are you right? Jade's date is 32-year-old entrepreneur Adam. Hey, right. Really? Yes. Right. Very good. This non-smoking, homeowning, fast car-driving gentleman could be the one to tick Jade's boxes. It's important for me that whoever I get with takes care of himself. Every time you, you see them, you've got to think to yourself, wow. I think you're in luck tonight, Adam. Yeah. But you've definitely got to be able to be up for a laugh. Hi. Oh, how's it going? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Mm, wow. Pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you. What's your name? Hey, Adam. Hi, Adam. I'm Jade. What are you drinking? Um, I'm on the porn stars. Oh, nice. You're a cocktail guy or? Yeah, I'll have one of them. Please, yeah. Yeah, yeah mine. Why not? So, where are you from? Uh, Blackpool. Oh, yeah, I was not far, is it? Yeah, where are you from? Liverpool. That was my instant reaction. I'm at the Scouse Mini Mouse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you do? Um, I own a website company. Oh, yeah. yeah, so I'm a bit of a geek to be fair. Um, underwear's for my model. Wow. <laughs> I find it hard to be single. I can't function properly. So I'd love it if you did actually match me with someone that I thought, wow, I could actually, you know, see my life with this person. So, like, what's your perfect, like, holiday? <sighs> a mixture. I go on, like, a little city break. Yeah, I'm running to the city once. Oh, yeah. We went to room. I just wanted to stay in the room. <laughs> you, me friend Why? went to, come on, we'll go out, we'll go and see. Oh, what's it called? The big, there's columns. The Coliseum? Yeah, the Coliseum. Yeah, yeah. And then you stand there and you can basically just see on the internet what you see in front of you. Thank you. 22-year-old DJ Nancy 
is hoping her old-fashioned love story is about to begin. I'm a massive old romantic. I was born in the wrong era. Hi. Good evening, how are you? I'm good, thank you, how are you? Good, thank you. What's your name, please? Nancy. You look great. Oh, thank you. <laughs> girls like grow up and they want that dream fairy tale. I'd love to just like walk out of a shop, bump into someone, I drop everything on the floor, they help me pick it up and we daze into each other's eyes. And then the violinist comes out. Uh, what can I get you? Disarano and Diet Coke please. My relationships in the past have been terrible. It's like I walk around with a sign just saying like psychos please come here. <laughs> And what do you do? I'm a DJ. Oh, cool. Where do you play? This year I'm in Ibiza, Zante. I've not been to Ibiza since 92. Back in the old raving days. <laughs> <laughs> She's a pretty lady. She's buff. Right, what's the betting that the guy that walks in is like a Sam type guy or Austin type guy? Cool, swanky, swagged out. Hello, how are you? Oh, oh, oh. Hang on a minute. Hello. Nancy's date is estate agent and raver, Nora. I love raving. I spend the summer in Ibiza when you're in the club and, like, beat drops. <laughs> Nothing in the world beats that feeling. Here we are. Hi. Oh, my God. You all right? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, I'm in awe. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you literally just went... <laughs> <laughs> So how old are you? 27. 27, 22. You're tiny. I'm so down to figure, yeah. Oh, my God, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'm a little bit street, so I normally get good girls. It's like I'm, I'm the girl they want to be. I'm a bit of a wild child. Yeah, I need to be tamed. So what do you do, like, work-wise and stuff? Uh, I'm a DJ. Really? Oh my yeah. god, I love that. <laughs> are you? What kind of music are you into? House. House. Oh my god. <laughs> Shall I take you through? Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you. After you. After you, yeah. ladies first. I'll check you out. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi, yeah. How are we doing? Yeah, good, yeah good. good. Have you had a chance to look at the menu? I'm looking at it at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ember the, the Flatter. One. That was a good oh, one. I've heard that one before. <laughs> I like it. Thank, Thank you. you. I used to have a top knot like that. Oh, my God, what, like, the ti like a tiny one? Mine was, like, my ear was down here. Was it? Only uh, just before Christmas. So weird, cos, um... <laughs> I always, like, say it to people, like, straight away. I don't have any hair. I wear a wig. OK. This is going to freak you. came over at the wrong time. And I've got a tattoo on the side of my head. Oh, wow. Why do you wear a wig? I've got um, alopecia, um, so my hair just... It just falls out. That suits you. <laughs> but, um... Yeah. I've, like, thrown you off guard now, haven't I? That's <laughs> a bit like... It's like a shock. It's like, yeah. oh, my God. It's so annoying to put back on. Keep, keep it off. <laughs> I'm going to... I'll be back in, like, two seconds. One of the main reasons why I wanted to do beauty was, you know, I went through school, I was bullied, all that, you don't have any eyebrows. I don't ever remember feeling, like, upset about it. But I've happened now. <laughs> um, it's really hard. It's really hard. Oh my god! You know, my parents have to say really hard for for me to have nice hair. Like my dad, he works so hard. He drew all my first set of eyebrows. <laughs> I'd love somebody like my dad, a bit taller. And he's got no hair like me, so somebody with a bit more hair, you know, give our kids a chance. <laughs> Is there any way I can leave this? I will look after it for you, don't Thank worry. You. <laughs> <laughs> you're beautiful. Thank you. Thanks. Good on. This is probably like the weirdest state you've ever been on. 
The best date I've been on. I like it, you. You're unique. Make sure you subscribe to get a regular serving of love and romance.